In the world of cryptocurrency, there are two main types of transactions, on-chain and off-chain. But what exactly is the difference between them? Keep watching to learn more about on-chain versus off-chain transactions. What is on-chain? On-chain transactions, as suggested by its name, are transactions that take place directly on the blockchain. Bitcoin is a great example of a decentralized network that does all of the transactions of the network on-chain. From the validation process by network participants to the verification process by miners working round the clock to add new blocks of transactions to the public ledger roughly every 10 minutes. Advantages Taking Bitcoin as an example, users can enjoy its highly secure, transparent, and decentralized network with a 99.986% uptime when transacting on-chain. Disadvantages However, since Bitcoin was first created, the number of users transacting on the network has increased exponentially to more than 180 million people. The growing demand means that users must wait longer for transactions to go through, with those willing to pay higher transaction fees receiving priority. For example, if you send Bitcoin from your wallet to another wallet at another exchange, the transaction will happen on-chain with a longer transaction confirmation time and higher transaction fees. But what if transactions didn't have to happen directly on the blockchain? What is off-chain? In off-chain transactions, transactions happen outside of the blockchain. It can be done through a separate transfer agreed upon by both parties, with a third party acting as a guarantor, helping to validate and verify the terms of the agreement. Or, the transaction can occur through a Layer 2 scaling solution, which is a separate blockchain built on top of the existing main one. Either way, off-chain solutions process all the back-and-forth transfers between parties. Once all the terms and conditions of the transaction have been met and both parties have completed their transactions, the final amounts are sent to both parties and the transaction is executed and recorded on the blockchain. Advantages Relieving the blockchain of many transactions results in rapid and fast transactions, with none of the additional transaction fees associated with on-chain transactions. Transfers are also not made public on the blockchain, which some people may like because it gives them more privacy. Disadvantages But even though off-chain transactions are faster, cheaper, and more private, they may not offer the same level of security, reliability, and openness that blockchain technology does. Bitcoin, in particular, has never been hacked or had counterfeit or double spending issues. Examples Bitcoin Lightning Network Bitcoin is championing the Lightning Network Layer 2 protocol because of how it relieves network congestion for the Bitcoin blockchain. By creating a separate channel outside the blockchain, where two transacting parties can send one another Bitcoin at low costs and faster confirmation times, Bitcoin's Lightning Network offers a scaling solution that its 400,000 daily active users can enjoy. So, what's your preference? On-chain or off-chain? Let us know in the comments.